We all feel a little awkward when going to a party, right? But for me, it's on another level. Oh, I don't even know why I came here. It's time you meet my usual antagonizers. There's the judgmental gaze. Who invited this lame? Child, her old awkward ass. Okay. I just came. Where am I? <laughs> girl, she's in hell. <laughs> oh, that girl is on fire. <laughs> okay. <laughs> she's burnt. <laughs> oh. Come on, Chris. I just, I'm dead. Child, I'm dead. Girl, am I alive? <laughs> no. <laughs> There's the fashion gaze. God, look at him. He's not even in our league. Why would he come to this party? <laughs> Looking like somebody's clown. Okay. Looking like Pennywise. Pennywise. <laughs> <laughs> and the just oh, messy God. gaze. Jerome's parties have really gone down in quality lately. We all feel a little awkward when going to a party, right? But for me, it's on another level. Well, at least in my head. Oh, I hope I ain't got a booger in my nose. Oh, there go my real friends right there. I be tripping, y'all. All this shit is just in my head. <laughs> So episode six, Club Loser, you see my character kind of like walk into a party and he's awkward and, and like feels like he doesn't fit in. And really this is all in his head, but uh, he just is trying to figure out what space he fits into. And then we kind of like dive into what is like these gay archetypes, not the stereotype, but like, you know, there's like in the series, you see judgmental gays, fashion gays, just messy gays and like, you see their perspective on like Chris and you see what like what they think about him um and I think one thing I wanted to show with this episode is like not all gay spaces are safe spaces like you know walk into a space where you're around other gays doesn't mean that you feel like you fit in or that you uh that everyone there is in your best interest which that's the case for most places but like I think there's this idea that like oh, you're gay, like all gays get along, all gays like are the same, like here's this one version of what a gay person is, but it's just like black people, like we are not, you know, monolithic. We have like very varying experiences and, and ways that we carry ourselves and, and how we identify. And so that's what I want to show is like he walked into the space and he's just like, um, I don't fit in and I feel like everyone's judging me and like my clothes and like the way that I look or the way that I like act um, and really like I said this is all in his head but like he snaps back into reality he finds his friends he finds his group and everyone is like cool uh, but I mean that's not that's not real life like not always is it that you that everyone is there rooting for you